Some players may not be able to launch Valorant right away due to one annoying error that says, your game requires a system restart to play. Please restart your computer. If this issue continues, reach out to our player support team. This error message shows up on the main screen of the game and can persist if not addressed properly. Here are the solutions that you can do if you find yourself dealing with Valorant system reboot required error. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issues so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. Fix number 1. Reboot your PC. If you haven't tried it yet, be sure to follow the message and simply restart your machine. If that won't do anything, then continue with the rest of the solutions. Fix number 2. Run the game in administrator mode. By design, Valorant should run normally whether it's on administrator mode or not. However, some security settings may limit certain programs from running and may require them to be running with an administrator privilege only. Right-click on Valorant and select Open File Location. Once you see the Valorant shortcut, right-click on it and select Properties. Go to Compatibility tab. Make sure that Run This Program as an Administrator is checked. Click Apply, then hit OK. Fix number 3, Disable Full Screen Optimizations If running Valorant as an administrator did not do anything, the next thing that you can do is to ensure that the game is not running full screen optimizations. To do that, you have to head over to the Compatibility tab after right-clicking on the Valorant shortcut. Once you're in the Compatibility tab, make sure to put a checkmark for Disable Full Screen Optimizations. This option is not checked by default so removing the check on the box should turn off full screen optimization settings. Fix number 4, change Vanguard service to automatic. Valorant requires Vanguard anti-cheat or VGC service to be running all the time. If this service has been disabled for some reason, it can be the reason why the game won't launch and showing the system reboot required error. Open the run dialog box by pressing the Windows key plus R on your keyboard. Type msconfig and press enter. Select services tab. Find VGC and tick the box beside it to turn it on. Hit apply and click OK. Click restart to restart your computer. Once the PC has restarted, run Valorant and check if the system reboot required error returns. If it does, you'll have to ensure that VGC is set to run automatically. Open the run dialog box again. Type services.msc and press enter. Find VGC and right click on it. Select properties. In startup type, click on the down arrow and select automatic. Hit apply and click OK. Restart your PC again then run the game to check for the problem. <music> Fix number 5, check for updates to your device drivers. Keeping your drivers up to date must be done in a regular basis whether you have a problem or not. This is especially important for the graphics card. By default, your GPU should have an automatic setting to allow Windows to scan the internet for drivers. However, you can always manually check for drivers anytime. Fix number 6, Delete and Reinstall Valorant. If the above solutions won't help, you have no other option but Delete and Reinstall Valorant. Simply open the control panel, select the Add, Remove Programs option, and uninstall Valorant from there. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends, this can greatly help